Welcome back. So when we left off on Friday, we had finished milling um, the right-hand side inner door frame. And so on Friday evening, I started the one on the mill for the left-hand side. And this is Monday morning now. And just running the swarf cuts to finish things off. And also had to do the undercuts at the top of the door frame. But basically, uh, that one's all done now. So that's both door frames, inner door frames done. So here's Mark actually waxing one of the outer door frames and so the goal right now is to get the uh, both doors done and the inner door frames done so we can get those um, laid up and sort of made it up with the rest of the fuselage before we can actually bond anything together. So that's kind of our current goal. And meanwhile we're still sort of finishing off some of the um, items from uh, before Oshkosh and this is the mold for the braces for the glare shield so that one's um, been all trimmed off now and cleaned up so that'll get waxed up eventually and we'll be able to lay up those parts and here's the outer door skins uh, for the lower side so these have had their primer and they're sort of uh, moving along through the regular stages of being primed and then sanded and then uh, primed again so they're um, getting closer to being done and next up there's a few other pieces still for the doors to be completed so this is one of the upper door skins that's basically above the window and we'd done this mold before but I wasn't happy with it because it was one of the actually very first one we did so we decided to do them again and here it is sort of finished off actually with a bit of a, a gouge in it there when it transitioned from one cut to the other but not a big deal we just filled that with some uh, uh, resin and cabosil and glassed it so that one, um, see that's just straight off the mill and actually coming out really good. Super happy now with uh, the machine and the fact that the Z axis is, is dialed in perfectly. So here's, uh, I guess that's Zach sanding there on those door uh, skins again after having the guide coat put on them. And there's the upper door skins. Both of them now have been glassed and actually the guys just rocked it out. This is today. So Tuesday they, they did both of those and there's another um, part there you can see behind it. This is actually a frame that the window sits in and it's actually bonded into the back of the door frame. And I haven't had a chance to really show you the detail but basically there's two of those and we did all four of these things in one day basically. And here are the actual inner door frames again and this time they've had the guide coat placed on them. so ready for the first go round of the sanding and they came out really well uh, under the ball mill pass still need uh, some sanding but really not uh, half as much work as what we've had to do um, prior especially using a ball mill on there which leaves you know just little ridges everywhere and not to be forgotten we still have to lay up the other mold for the nose gear brace so we cleaned up the plug here or actually the guys cleaned up the plug and put the uh, rubber profile on uh, for that one so that's ready. So a while back I think I showed you I was cut out these boards uh, using the CNC and these are so we can make the outer door frame molds um, in about five different pieces so today I actually had to cut all these bits of foam kind of by hand and they just support those boards at the right angle but you'll see those uh, soon as we uh, lay those into place before pulling the molds. And as I said earlier the guys really rocked it today and got all four of these uh, different plugs glassed and so they're laying on the floor they're ready for putty so Jeff's basically just about to spray those and here's the outer door skins again so they got through their first uh, and second round of sanding got primed again so then now they're ready for sanding with 320 and then probably 400 and ultimately waxing and then we'll be able to pull the molds from those and in they came out fine no problems there really Here the guys are just starting on sanding the inner door frames and these are the ones that run over the weekend with the ball mill, the one on Friday and then on then over the weekend and they're saying they're not really having too many problems with that so that's good news. And uh, here are those four platforms, um, had the putty or a couple of goats of putty on there so Jeff's just finishing those off and next you'll see actually got the first one up and it's going to run um, for about 12 hours tonight because I'm doing it with like a 20th hour step over in uh, with a ball mill 
So lastly, um, if anybody knows of someone in the Atlanta area who's looking for a job, we're actually got a couple of openings right now. So if, if someone's interested, can you have them contact me? Uh, my details are on the website. Anyway, that's our update for the first half of this week. Thanks again for watching.